when you bring two uh, organisations together that that's had a massive uh, impact on your life you know, you, you want to you want to do something to give back because you know it'll benefit everybody else um, so on 10th it's going to be uh, in student union we're going to have a music night with acts from Converge uh, from all backgrounds students uh, tutors um, and we're going to perform, perform the live uh, launch of the CD so uh, that's that's a challenge in itself it's been my lifeline um, it's given me confidence, it's given me the social skills, like I've said. It's, uh, it's given me the trust again um, and it's enabled me to do things that I've never thought I would ever do. Um, and it, I'm getting out more, I'm socialising more. Uh, I'm always busy and I love it. When you experience it, to, to see from somebody that's maybe going through distress and then you see how they develop, how they progress, how doors open up for them, what you can do to help and encourage um, inspire them, um, work with them, become friends with them, um, to see where they go and where they end up is such a buzz to, to know that you've maybe just played a little part in that. At the end of the day each, each person is individual and it always comes back down to that sole individual that it's down to them to where they push and, and progress. We're just all here to help and support and put them hopefully in a good place and the right direction. We don't have any guaranteed central funding whatsoever. Uh, we operate on a budget of around about £54,000, so in addition to delivering the over 30 activities and services that we do, um, we have to get out there and find this money from somewhere. So when somebody, particularly a member like Pat, um, comes on board and decides she'll do something for us, it's phenomenal. It means that profile is being raised uh, by a member who appreciates the services and who is putting something together. And given uh, the limited budget that we operate on, um, any kind of contribution is massive. Uh, we have over 625 uh, women registered as members of Kira. And if I put that into some context for you, uh, they made over 4,000 visits to Kira last year. The 40 or so women volunteers that we have um, are currently putting in excess of 5,000 volunteer hours a year. So we feel that the contribution that we're making to our community, and remember it's unique to York, is phenomenal. And we would hate to see that go under because we don't have the money to do it.